Currently, there is no law in Nevada that prohibits cell phone use while driving. News source Brooke Boone attended the launch of the No Phone Zone Nevada campaign today in Reno and says lawmakers and state officials have a bigger goal in mind. Brooke? Yes, distracted driving plays a part in more than 3,500 traffic crashes in Nevada yearly. But a group of Nevada lawmakers hopes to change that by pushing through a bill to ban texting while driving this upcoming session. What I want to know is, will that be enough to make people put down the phone? Here's what I found out. Distracted driving can mean eating, talking on the phone, texting, anything that takes your attention away from the road. Assemblywoman Debbie Smith of Spark says the number of people on cell phones has gone up, and so have the number of accidents caused by distracted driving. And all you have to do is sit at an intersection and watch people drive by. So I did just that. I've been standing on the corner of Plum and Harvard for 10 minutes. And during that time, I've counted at least 10 drivers either talking or texting. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration has called it an epidemic. So you just got one cone. So you just got one wreck. The Washoe County Sheriff's Office joined forces with local and state agencies to provide a hands-on look at distracted driving. A group of students drove through a cone course while being subjected to various distractions. They were asked to talk on the phone, turn on the radio, and text. We see another cone, so you just got in the second wreck. Jennifer Watkins told students her story today. She was hit by a distracted driver in 2004. Her car was totaled, and she has been through six surgeries. But after everything, one student told me that a law would not necessarily stop him or his friends from texting. So what will it take then? I think it'll be hard to enforce. Why is that? Because there's a lot of people that do it, and you can't really stop everybody. Lawmakers believe even if they prevent one person from texting while driving, that would be enough. 30 states have passed a law that prohibits texting while driving. Joe, back to you. Here are key points. This was a strong example of going the extra step. It included several strong storytelling elements. To raise the bar, start with the strongest element to pull viewers in. For example, the survey of drivers, which set the story apart. That was excellent. Also, try to get local information. If police don't keep track locally, tell viewers.